Hey, Rhett. Hey, Link. It's me, NASA. And I wanted to let you know that, yes, I have tried a neti pot. I think if I remember correctly, um, Miss, uh, Miss Locklear had one of these. And didn't she do a class about it? I feel like she did. Uh, or maybe it was Miss Slaughter. I don't remember. But um, I actually have two neti pots. Check that out. Now, I wouldn't recommend doing it at the same time. That would not be good. But uh, one is for my wife, and one, yes, I did get married, and one is for me. I have the porcelain one because I was the first one to get one, and then my wife got this one. Whenever my wife got this one, though, I was a little confused as to its design because this part right here seems very phallic, and I think yours seemed uh, to be very similar uh, in shape. But uh, I have you, in fact, I was just sick. Uh, about a week or two ago, and uh, uh, probably about two weeks ago, and I used my neti pot because I was clogged, like seriously clogged, and I was having pain in my sinuses, which was not good. So I decided to, for about three days, I did my neti pot once a day in the morning, and uh, you know, run the water through. One thing I did want to let you know is that I have had some of uh, water come out of my mouth because whenever I do my neti pot, I, kind of, I lean over and then I kind of hang my mouth open and I can feel it kind of going into my mouth. But then if I go too far down, I notice that it starts coming out of my eye. So, And just to let you all know, your sinuses are all connected up into your eyes, into the back of your throat and in your mouth and whatnot. So whenever you're uh, neti potting, make sure you get in the perfect position or else it may start kind of burning uh, in your eyes, or, or it will start coming out your mouth, and it'll feel like salt, like you drank ocean water. Uh, second thing that I wanted to mention about the neti pot is... I don't remember. What was it? Uh, neti pot, neti pot, neti pot. Don't remember. Oh, wait. Uh, once you're done, this wasn't what it was. Now, Red, once you're done with your neti pot, once you've, you know, completed the whole water cycle, blow kind of forcefully into the sink like that, and that'll get all of the extra water that's in there so that you don't make it rain in the club whenever uh, you go out clubbing. And uh, another thing that helps me is once I've sprayed into the sink. Not only does it help to get some of the loose mucus out, but I also get some toilet paper and I blow my nose each nostril and that usually helps to progress it even further. So uh, just a couple tips from your good old school friend NASA about these fun little contraptions called neti pots. I hope that was helpful for you guys and uh, maybe one day we can do a neti pot video together. I've done plenty of neti potting on my vlog channel if you want to check that out, it's youtube.com slash thefunnyrats. Maybe I should just make a video of, uh, of me holding my neti pot the entire way. Okay, that might be a little weird. Maybe I'll do a video on my main channel about this. Okay, bye! What you gonna pick? It's time to watch another flick. So click, 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 click. Another video. Click, 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 click. Another video. Click, click. Or you can be really awesome and just click that big yellow subscribe button.